Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and this is a quick update for Google Chrome. Chrome 108 is now available. This is the last new version of Chrome for the year, as the next version, Chrome 109, will arrive only in January, on January 10th exactly. So this was released November 29th yesterday, and so you can check out if you have the latest version. Not a lot to offer in here. Um, upper right corner, three vertical dots, go into help, go about Google Chrome. In here, you will see 108.0.5359.72 ish, because some of you might be 71, 72, 73. There's always a small difference depending on where you update and how you update on your computer. Now, uh, what's new in here? Uh, nothing much. One of them has to do with better support for Color V1 in fonts and emojis. And the other one has to do with the um, energy saver mode that is available. But it is actually a uh, hidden feature, but was added. So basically what happens is that if you go into your uh, Chrome and Flags, you will actually have, if you look uh, or search for battery, you will have the battery save remote feature in the settings. Now, I enabled it because by its default, and default means it's turned off right now. It's a way for you to try to have Chrome use less energy on your computer. So once this is enabled, what happens is that once you actually go into your settings, if you search for battery, battery there we go uh, you got power and in power there's energy saver it says turn on only when my battery is at 20 percent lower or turn on when my computer is unplugged so what that does is that it will actually here I'm gonna change it like this as I use the battery sometimes and I do not use Chrome much but anyways if I do use it uh, apparently, it will actually uh, limit the um, visual effects. It will limit some of the stuff that actually is power hog in Chrome. And God knows a lot of people are complaining about how Chrome is a big power hog and has uses a lot of resources. So you have to go into Chrome, Flags, and find the Enable the Battery Saver Mode feature in order for that to work. But once that is done, you are having that new feature. For the rest, only developer side stuff, so uh, nothing for the standard user. Um, and of course, a host of improvements in security updates, and we're gonna talk about that because even if you don't care about the new features, for the security, it might be important. We're gonna talk about it in the next video. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.